Quick check of the tropics coming up because we do have tropical storm Ada in the Gulf, although it's starting to move almost out of the Gulf as it continues in a path almost in the direction of the uh, Yucatan uh, Pass or the Yucatan Channel between the Yucatan Peninsula and Cuba. There is a center of the storm almost out of radar range. It is a fairly small storm, but as I mentioned, it is still moving away from Florida. What we're likely to see overnight and into tomorrow is the storm go almost stationary and just basically sit in this location and then finally start lifting northward as we get later into Tuesday and Wednesday. And during that time, the Hurricane Center is expecting the storm to strengthen. Winds right now of 50 miles an hour. Hurricane Center is thinking by later into the end of the day tomorrow and into early Wednesday morning winds coming up to 70 miles an hour, so putting it just below that of a hurricane. But then notice as we go into Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, weakening the winds coming down and it becomes more or less a depression and then a remnant low before making landfall. So right now the Hurricane Center is not thinking that this will make landfall as a named storm, possibly as a depression, but maybe even below that strength. So with a little more of Southeast Louisiana within the cone, note that at this point it would be a remnant system, a weakening system. So basically a rainmaker and uh, this model or this forecast is not written in stone as models are still over all over the place. You have a little bit more of a consensus taking the storm due north by tomorrow, but there are still a few that kind of bring that low south of Louisiana and move it up in our direction this weekend, but as a rainmaker and this is the GFS and that's kind of what the GFS is thinking kind of branching off from what the Hurricane Center is thinking is and taking that rainmaker toward us as we get into Saturday, which at the moment would be just rainfall. There may be some gusty winds, especially offshore, but that would be about it. So right now, that's what we're looking at. Dry air across the Gulf of Mexico and increasing wind shear is on the way. That is going to start weakening Ada as it moves northward. So at whatever point it starts reaching the northern Gulf of Mexico, it will be that of a far, far weaker storm. So don't let that concern you that we are once again in the cone of uncertainty really more than anything. It's just kind of an historical note that for the eighth time this season we're under it, but not too concerned about it. We're going to stay pretty quiet and dry through the rest of this week and at the moment looking at our better rain chances on Saturday and hopefully a cold front as we get into early next week.